Eau Rouge, Radion, the bus stop chicane. Iconic turn names and an iconic circuit. History lives here at Spa-Francorchamps at the Belgium Grand Prix. Spa-Francorchamps then, a historic 19-corner circuit with a lap distance of 4.35 miles. There's over 100 metres of elevation change here and with long stretches of the lap spent flat out, a good top speed will be vital for success. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. An immense lap from Lewis Hamilton yesterday puts him on pole position. Edging out Max Verstappen, who'll start from P2. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Stroll, Russell, Leclerc, Fernando Alonso, Oscar Piastri, Norris, Perez, Sainz, Magnussen, Albon, Hulkenberg, Sargent, Gasly, Ocon, Ricardo, Sonoda, Joe, and Valtteri Bottas begins the race from the back of the grid. Now it's almost time for lights out, so let's go down to the track. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here, but I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, I imagine they'll be starting to feel the adrenaline as they anticipate the rundown into Turn 1, a bit like preparing to go into battle. The unknown situation will bring nerves, but that's a good thing. It will keep them focused on the moment and on their surroundings as we build towards the start of the Grand Prix.
job. That was the fastest lap of the race so far. OK, so we're leading our teammate by 8.7 seconds. Superb driving. That is the race win, my friend. Well done. And here's our winner pulling their Ferrari into Park Ferme after a fantastic race. Anthony Davidson. What helped them deliver this result, do you think? Well, they certainly stood out as a driver with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts of the race, meant they were able to capitalise on the mistakes of other drivers, giving them the opportunity to make their way to the top spot with ease. Ferrari are at it again. An excellent performance at today's Grand Prix, and they're certainly a team that know what they're doing out there.
Now, let's discuss Ant. Who would you say is a contender for...